and welcome back to a brand new video. So today, I will be setting up the TicWatch E. So I just unboxed this, and it's a really nice watch. The only thing I think is that the bezel is a bit thick, but other than that, it is a very good watch. And you know, it feels nice, and everything about it seems great. So yeah, I'm just going to go ahead and set it up. So here's the charging cord, and here's the manual. So I'm going to open up the manual. It says, Welcome to the Tick Watch community. You can read that if you would like. And here is the kind of map, if you call it that, of the Tick Watch. So it says, Long press power on and to activate Google Assistant when watch is on. Press to return to the watch face home screen. Press again to show the app list. Press to light up the screen. Got some information. Accessories and look. Microphone is on the back. Dynamic heart rate sensor, charging port, speaker. And it is a magnetic type contactor charging. And it is IP67 water resistant. Setting up and getting started, pairing with Android or app. So you have to download the Android or app. Press the crown to turn on the tick watch. And it shows how to pair. So you're gonna download Android Wear smartwatch. As well as the tick watch app. So I'm going to go ahead and open up the charging cable and plug in the watch. So this is the part that actually goes on to the watch. It's magnetic. So it connects like so. Right there. So you can see the pins. And they just connect magnetically. So for the charging, you will need a something to plug in the USB to that will go into the wall. And so I'm just going to use this old phone charger. It says very small, but it says 5 volts, which is the output that you need. As said in the manual right there, you can see it says input voltage 5 volts. So most, I'm not sure about Apple, but I know Android phone pieces that go into the wall they are 5 volts so you can just take this USB and plug it into the side and go ahead and plug this into your wall outlet so you can see I have this in this magnetic piece and it's plugged into the wall I can just clip it on like so and now the watch is turning on The Mob Boy logo. There it goes, Android Wear. Just tap to begin. It's asking me to select language. So I'm going to go to English, United States. Agree to the user agreement. I'm going to agree. Says download and open Android Wear on your phone and then connect this watch name. So I'm opening up the Android Wear app. I'm going to set it up. Agree. Allow. And it's already picked up the watch, so you can click on it. It says it's connecting. Now it's asking to connect, so I'm going to say pair, now it's connecting, now it's asking me to copy my Google accounts to my watch, so I'm going to select my account, next.
and it wants me to confirm my screen up to continue setup. Next, I have to enter my pin. So I just entered in my pin. It says copy to your watch. I'm gonna say copy. I'm gonna connect to Wi-Fi. I just logged in with my account. access and now I'm all set so done and now my watch is ready so I can change the watch face for more so I just chose this watch face right here now I have a little thing right here Tap to get more details. Okay. Click right to exit. Press power button to go back to the watch face. Press button to see all apps. That's a Google Assistant. And the home button. And if I click it again, I have my app drawer. So, yeah, hope you found this video helpful so you can set up your pick watch. Thank you for watching, and I will see you in the next video.